Tootie Raw speaks on his beef with TBG and Fredo Bang while Boosie pays his respects to Mo 3's mom. And Lil Mosey speaks on his case. Let's get into it, man. Make sure you hit that like, share, and subscribe. Now, Tootie Raw has been going back and forth with people who are affiliated with TBG, but he had this to say today. Check it out. Hey, I ain't beefing with TBG. Hey. I ain't beefing with TBG. Now, some people in the uh, comment se section said he obviously, obviously going to say that because y'all police. Um, somebody else said, boy, you quick with the man just ended the live. That's speaking on how the blogs are actually covering this as well. Somebody else said, "In better go take care of them twins he got, which he did just recently have two children. Now, the beef to me was more between Tootie Raw and Lil Ivy. Now, we know the backstory between Boosie, the father of Tootie Raw, and Ivy, the father of Lil Ivy. Um, I'm not for sure if it's a total beef between them or not. It's looked like it for quite some time. Even going as far as to the diss on that Tootie Raw did about Lil Ivy, we had a clip of a video with Fredo Bang actually listening to that particular song. So this could be just one of those things. Somebody just said something on social media, so it ain't hot. Now, in other news, we have Boosie, who just threw the Boosie bash in Baton Rouge and... During that, he did something dope for Mo3. Check it out. Now, I thought that was pretty dope for him to actually donate money to uh, Mo3's mother and the family and whatever their situation may be. Uh, Mo3 has seen a lot of success since his demise, uh, especially with the song Outside. I heard it all summer. A lot of people are still playing, and this is actually what's playing in the background of this video. Now, we know that Boosie went to pay his respects after the passing of Mo3 and actually got hit up. While he was down in Dallas. But I thought it was dope. You know him giving 25k to the mom. You know some people will still have something to say. But hey. I, I, I call you know I call a spade a spade. I feel like Boosie did something dope. In this particular situation. Now on to the last subject. We talking about Lil Mosey. Now Lil Mosey actually caught a case. Uh, TMZ had posted up some information on his case. A while back, and uh, he was hit with a stay away order in this particular case. Now, he's accused of doing something crazy with the female. Now, it's a second degree charge. Um, he hasn't went to jail for it yet. Uh, he hasn't been tried or anything yet like that, but he's accused at this particular time. Um, the incident happened back in January, according to TMZ. Now, he had this to say on his uh, actual Twitter page. He posted this and it said, I ain't have no dad growing up. I was with my mom, so why TF would you ever think I would touch that wrong? Um, I gotta be careful how you know report on some of these stories. Like I always say, tell y'all, you know, they be on it. Um, YouTube is definitely on it, but at the end of the day, uh, I think that I uh. You know, I really don't have enough information on what actually took place. A lot of times people get accused of things that they didn't do. Then sometimes people get away with things that they actually really did, even when people accuse them. So I'm not particularly sure the details behind this incident. Um, Hopefully things get worked out in, fa in the favor of maybe, uh, you know, the person that was done wrong or the person that was wrongly accused. You know, I got to watch what I say with that. But uh, get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think about this. I'm Almighty the Ruler. Make sure you hit that like, share, and subscribe, and click that notification bell so you get notified each and every time I upload new content. Peace.